And if you ask business owners what their number one pain points are, I don't know what, who the fuck I am. I don't know what my story is. I don't know how to go get new customers and I have no clue what it looks like to scale my, my business. You have four minutes. What's that movie where they say too weird to live? And too rare to die. Uh, I don't know. Too weird to live? Too Oh, rare it's to die? from Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas. <laughs> One of the things that I came back from Gorkron really wanting to get like clear on is what our story is okay and uh sort of what i realized at the 90 day planning session and just in who i've been this last week like i've had some traumatic shifts in context and values and whatever and what i've come up with is i think a fairly compelling articulation around like what it is we do for people when people ask who we are the answer is that we're a media company um, measurable Genius helps our clients find their story, acquire new leads, and scale their businesses. Our focus on story is values and strategy. Acquiring new leads is strategy and marketing. And then scale their company is strategy and infrastructure and projects. And so it's like we really just do those three things. We help people find their story, acquire new leads, and grow their companies. And we do that polymathically. Well, and that's why I was going into the story piece, because as soon as you start telling the story, uh, I think that we can leverage up this type of thing relatively easily. Great. Hey. Man, this video quality is going to be insane. Hey, Warren? <laughs> You're going to be able to get like real B-roll and shit from me. I feel just like this last week was hectic was hectic so i just made lots of decisions to not do that one thing camera shooting camera okay <laughs> so i think it'll be okay i think a studio is going to become necessary and i think that that's something we can basically have our clients pay us for like we can have a studio paid for by our clients and by prospects in like 30 days or less we go by like six costco tvs we go downtown and we rent office space for zero dollars on a fucking yeah zero dollars right now and we've got a fucking studio and now we can like do studio rental time nobody in calgary is doing that there's not a single person i would have been targeted right i am the prospect for someone who needs studio services and nobody has them right so we have our clients every one of our clients all of a sudden we can be the people that give them their show we do like a beautiful Photoshop background image for the, for the TVs and they come in and they sit in our studio and they do their show and they pay X amount of money. That's a flashy enough product that sells itself, doesn't need ex explanation in terms of what you're doing. No. It's studio space. All we do is do a video of the video studio and we're like, yo, I'll use this Osmo thing. Be like, yo, I'm just here in my studio. We just set this up. <laughs> Why TVs and not a green screen? Because green screen looks like shit when people are sitting in front of them. Whereas TVs provide backlighting and high resolution display. And because I'm modeling Grant Cardone and that's exactly what he did and so I'm not gonna fucking make that. I've been trying to get this guy together. I've, always, I've been wanting to do something with you because I want to collaborate with straight, legit entrepreneurs. Just building that studio creates a recurring revenue asset. 